Today was the uh, inauguration of our new greenhouse facility here in West Sacramento, serving both uh, biologics and bare vegetable seeds. What it does is gives us really a state-of-the-art facility that's right on site. These are critical for biologics to be able to consistently produce plants that we can test our products on to drive the pipeline. For vegetable seeds, it's, uh, it enables them to be able to produce seed that they can send out for field testing. One third of the vegetables are produced in California for the rest of our country. And we're in vegetable seed. We have ideas that we have to translate into some form that we can use in our breeding programs around the world. Our goal is to help the breeders to improve their vegetables and fruits by using genetic techniques. So we're looking for genes that we can integrate into those populations or those hybrids that'll make them resistant in the field so that the breeders and the growers can have better yields across the nation. This is research that's going to help in aiding the way we think about agriculture and changing that and helping society to kind of come to this new um, thought process of what agriculture is and how we view it. Bayer has three technology platforms, the traditional small molecule products, plant genetics and traits, and then more recently the microbials or biologics. This is one of the, the three pillars to provide integrated solutions to growers. This types of investment uh, from private companies uh, you know, creates a strong economic foundation. For the West Sacramento community it's important because it's obviously an investment locally in the area. It provides jobs and it reflects our ongoing commitment to West Sacramento as a, a major research hub for buyer.